One more pick up, and it should be the gold lane. It sounds like the Irithel. No. So they're trying to counter the 1-1 one -one in that lane, and they also have the Lolita to counter the 1-1 one -one as well. Very clear that the side of the Valley, they want to go front to back, right? I mean, they drop at what they do. They are champions for a reason, but only one of them gets to go to the upper bracket. And we'll see who it is going to be. Ladies and gentlemen, are you Team The Valley or are you Team Hack? Put your predictions in the comments section as we are moments away of getting into the land of Dawn. But Gani, predictions before we get... Side. Let's see though, Moba Zane and Min, every member from the side of the valley except for the goalie is in the vicinity. Min uh, trying to pressure, Man finds the pressure fire and finds the first blood. Pride will go down, Gary will not be able to steal that one as Zane finds Min, pulls him back towards the backside but not enough damage to take him down just yet. Really? Team, yeah. It just really nicely played overall. I mean, Team Hawk understanding and especially Gary understanding that he just has to try and contest it. Wait, Min, he, is he dead here? Yeah, no sprints. I guess he will not be able to escape as Zane will collect the kill. But bot side. Woo. Oh, oh, He's oh. early on until they get those first items. So right now, Min is being a huge nuisance to Moba Zane there. What? I don't know how effective he is right now because he's not far behind Gary, but in the bottom side. The dire potential jumps in. One, two, three, bye, bye. Basic Gary will pick up the kill. And on top of that, he will get the extra goal. But now they re-engage from the valley. They will, they should not commit to this. I'll take a look at this 3v1 super shot. Mm. Will it go down next? The Valley, they really need to be careful on this one. Yeah, they cannot disrespect the Dyroth, and especially with the armor shred, it makes it so easy for someone like Ling to quickly cut down someone as tanky as Super Shark, who naturally has is farming relatively well. Lola, sends a danger shark with the stun. Dune as well, your combination comes in. Real relation, but take a look at the damage shark. Oh. Low oh. HP, he will not fall, and it will be Lola. Three on one is a little bit just too much. Honestly, the Valley, at this point, the laning phase is done and dusted. The question is, where do you find the gold effectively and safely? Oh, no. Take a look at the setup here. Mint falls, and now Gary yeah. tempers the blade just to escape. But take a look oh, at no. that hurricane dance. Finds the ling, and there you go. Bang, bang, bang. The Valley, and who in their right mind would be able to pin the ling there? It was beautiful, but look at this. Super Cross Shark. Crossbow of Tang. Find Super Shark, and now the Valley, they slow down the tempo. They need to be careful here. As his very first item after the boots, of course, but he needs to live and needs to start scaling. He hears Zane. Oh, take a look at the damage from the Dyroth, man. Heavy spin as a defense. Gary will confirm the last turtle in the Land of Dawn, and... Gideon, things are looking good for his information. Hot oh. might go for the mid side, but Lola oh. almost solo killing Zane there with the help of the conceal just to escape. Now mid side real manipulation just to pass clear. Far chicken misses the wild charge. And there you go. Teams in towards Zane just to zone in up. 10,000 in the HP Lord. Zane with the conceal That's will not be able to on time. But Nunum last catches too. And now the fight begins. One by one. Oh. Bodies falling. Basics down. And now Team Hawk, they want one. They want Hoon here, who is covered by Shark, but crossbow of Tang by Panda. One by oh! one, bye bye. Panda finds a double. Oh my Ooh, goodness, I was stressing wow. out there. I, I don't know about you, Eternal, but when you see a situation, Basic like is going to have a really rough time without some support. Man, 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 man. And they spawn man here. Oh, oh! Second watch out jumps in, and the follow up damage is just perfect. He falls as the Valley finds some slight Whoa. compensation. Oh, take a look at one one Panda. Whoa. Trying to find the crossbow with Tang. Not yet, though. The thing is, the Valley need to be very careful with the way that they're rotating. They're rotating as five, and that gives opportunity for Gary to try and pull another. Echo, but look at this. Min is going to get oh. caught out here. Oh, oh, they need to be careful here as the Lord will not be committed. But now, heavy spin as a defense. Is this right move? Oh. Oh, Zane gets taken down as the crossbow of Tang is just too huge. Finding the double. Can he get the triple? But oh my goodness, four bodies from the valley is in the land of dawn. White Chicken, the only one left to defend this base as Team Hack. They're looking to push that top and that 
mid side. Will it be enough here, Goni? We'll see. We'll see. Base turret top side will fall here. Why chicken the soul man while charge as a Hail Mary? And there you go. Team Hack will find the dub against the NA rep, the Belly. The next upper bracket slot is going to fall to the Malaysian representatives. Congratulations, Team Hack. And wow, what a game by them. Beautifully executed. Very well done. Very aggressive from that early game. And it was so difficult for them.